Don't tell your parents. Oh, there they are. Oh, I'll be taking these. Stupid piece of shit! <laughs> oh, this is fucking crazy! Oh, oh, oh. Oh, this is fucking crazy! Oh. <laughs> oh, you stupid piece of shit! We now return to as the chair turns. Why won't you ever rotate your chair, Samantha? All I ever asked of you is that you rotate your chair. I don't like rotating my chair. If you want this marriage to work, you'll rotate your chair, goddammit. Just use the right thumbstick and, and rotate your chair, Samantha. Yes, I know how to rotate, Reginald. I'm not an idiot. I know all I have to do is move the right thumbstick to the right or left to rotate my chair. I still refuse. Well, you never interact with objects by looking at them and pressing R2. Like the things on the ground or the things on, on, on the desk, Reginald. Why won't you look at the things on your desk or on the ground and interact with them by pressing R2, hmm? Just forget it, Samantha. We don't have time for this right now. The big staring contest is tonight. We need to practice if we expect to win. Yes, you're right. For once, Reginald. Yes, okay, staring contest. No one talks. First person to blink loses. Starting right now. Are we starting? Do you just... Okay, one, two, three, two, one. Starting now. You have four messages. Messages. You have four messages. You have four messages. Messages. Message one. <sighs> Jeff, 
staff, call me back. End of message. Message two. Your lawyer here. Not looking good, I'm afraid. Because the dogs were yours and because they seem to be powering this monster, you may be liable. Call me. End of message. Message three. Hey, asswipe! Your rent is due! This isn't a charity! End of message. Message four. Hey, it's Mom. I never did like those dogs of yours. I'm not surprised, to be honest. I mean, now they're powering that big old big monster. Sweetie, it's a big mess. Anyways, call me back. End of message. Hey, hey, open up! Come out here! Get out here! Get, open up! Come on, open up! Hello? Any oh yeah, this is definitely the right place. You're the one. Okay, listen to me. We don't have time to get into it right now, but you're coming with me. We interrupt this program for an important breaking news. A giant big monster, you heard that right, a motherfucking giant big monster has destroyed the science center, damn near half the city, stolen science equipment, microscopes, beakers, I'm talking about flames, things are really crazy right now, shit's all fucked up, and this goddamn big monster has dogs that are plucked into its eyes, and they are powering him up above any power level I've ever seen. And he's scared people, my grandmother's afraid. All right, back to your regular schedule program. Man, you really, you, your dogs, you have no idea how fucked things are because of your two stupid dogs. Ugh. This is a power baby. You're gonna be seeing a lot of these throughout the whole game. I mean, I really love them. I got them in my eyeballs, you know? In my eye holes, I mean. So just here, look at this one that I just pulled out of my eye and, and it'll come to you. Just look at it and it'll come to you. Y you trust me, it's gonna- you're gonna love this. Just look at it and it'll fly right out. <laughs> All right, listen, you're gonna control me, man, because I'm tired, okay? I, you know how long it took me to find you? I'm exhausted. So you're in control. I, I'm like a remote control character now, all right? The blue light that's shooting out of the ground, that's called the warp node. Get me over to the warp node. All right, let's get out of here. Get me to the blue light. All right, okay, so now listen, press R2 to warp over. It's the right trigger. Oh! All right, and that's how we do it. Let's go. Ah, uh, you want to soak this place in before we leave, huh? I, I get it. You know that monster that stole your dogs? His name is Glorcon. He's got your dogs plugged into his eyes like power babies. It, ma it made him unstoppable. You know, it took me forever to find you. Looked all over the place. Thank God, I'm gonna dump your ass off at my boss. I'm gonna get my space money. Then I'm gonna go to this place on my home world where I get all crazy messed up called Empty Peepers. But what do you know about that? You're just a dirty chair orpian. I'm sorry for being spacist. All right, come on, there's a light on your- Dude, are you fucking kidding me? You gotta jump over the gate, not just up in front of it. Come on, what is this, baby's first video game? Jump me over the gate. Sometime today, warp over. Wow, where are we headed? Doesn't look like we can go anywhere. Huh? <laughs> whoa! Whoa, 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 holy whoa, shit! Whoa. <laughs> whoa, whoa! Oh, well, look who it is. I'm locking you here and making a citizen's arrest. 
do you not think I don't know who you are, huh? Shake your head, yes or no? Answer me! No? Well, you're wrong. I do know who you are. You're the Cheropian with the dogs. Those dogs are in the eyes of that big monster and it is fucking everything up now because your dogs gave him some kind of superpowers. So we have you to blame for this bullshit that we're going through right now. Do you feel sorry for what you've done? Answer me, yes or no. Do you feel any remorse? Dude, just answer him so we can Whoa, get... well, I hope you're telling the truth. I hope you feel ashamed. You did this to us. You're a disgrace. The mayor told you to get rid of those dogs. Man, I don't have time for this bullshit. I got a motherfucking sword. You threaten me, boy? I ain't afraid of you. Come on, let's do it. Well, you should be, asshole. Let's beat this guy's ass. Press the square button. I ain't afraid of you. I served eight tours in the civil chair war. Or nine, or three. Doesn't matter. More than one. Yeah, I'm walkist. I'm trying to hurt your feelings. My father was a walkist. My grandpappy was a walkist. I voted for a walkist. I turn on the nose. Ah, just stop hitting me. <laughs> I turned on your warp nodes. <laughs> Don't hurt me no more with the knife. <laughs> oh, there's an old man. Please. Please don't hurt me. Haha, <laughs> you fucking cowards! You run, that's right, you run away from me! Man, I normally you don't get like that, cowards. but... <laughs> you fucking cowards! Man, that guy's that's an right, asshole! Like, hey, it's elderly uncle, abuse uncle. time! You're, a, you're, a, you're an Ow. idiot! Haha, <laughs> just fucking with you, old, old timer! Haha, <laughs> you fucking cowards! That's right, bitch! Run away from me, you criminal cowards! Big tough guy's hitting an old man, you fucking cowards! Haha, <laughs> you fucking cowards! You run, that's right, you run away from me, you criminal cowards! Haha, <laughs> you fucking cowards, that's right, bitch! Run away! What the hell? All the nodes are locked down again! Shit, we, we, we gotta look around and figure this out! My new phrase, together or not at all, partner. Shit, this is the science building we saw on the news. Look at all the stuff I got. Yeah, yeah, I got stuff too. Hey, what is all this stuff for? I don't know, but it's ours now. Hey, look, there's somebody we can beat up. Oh yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna rumble with that person. Hey, come here. I'm gonna kick your ass. Who the hell are these guys? I, I guess you gotta rumble. I hope you can handle this. You're gonna wish you never ran into whoever we are. Oh, you killed who my we friend. Are. That was my friend that you killed. We don't even know who we are, and you killed him. We didn't even get time to figure out who we are, or where we came from. No, uh, you killed my friend. You killed my best friend. And you just murdered him. He's gonna fucking murder you. You murdered my fucking friend. You murdered my friend. I'm gonna fucking kill you. I'm, 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 I'm gonna really. Huh. Well, that's that. All right, come on. Let's go to the telepod. It's back the other way. The inventor of science. The inventor of clones, huh? The inventor of black holes. The inventor of sitting. What an invention. What did you guys do before him? Just stand the whole time? And finally, we're at the telepod. This is the telepod. So telepods are, are, are how we get around, okay? That's how we travel in the cosmos. They teleport us to where we'd like to go. So we're gonna use it to go to my boss's office so I can drop your ass off, your stupid ass off, and get my space money and get the hell out of here, you know what I mean? And go live my life. Go ahead and hit the button to uh, teleport us to my boss's office. All right, go ahead and hit the button. Go ahead and press the button.
Press the button so we can get moving. And that's when I woke up and realized she was dead. Oh, Trover. Okay, boss, I'm sorry it took me so so long, but here's the chair Orpian, uh, in mint condition, so I'll take my space money and be on my way. Thank you very much. Actually, Trover, some things have changed since we've last talked. I'm gonna need you to stay partners with the chair Orpian. Your job's not over yet. Come on! You said all I had to do was find the stupid chair Orpian and bring them to you, and then, and then I'd get my space money! Trover, shut the fuck up. I have the abstainers on the hollow dish phone. <laughs> We are the abstainers. Holy shit, that's what the abstainers look like? They look just like the, the guy who's got the dogs in his eyes causing all this trouble. Shut the fuck up, Trover. No one needs to hear your commentary about everything. The abstainers would like to talk with the chair Orpian. It is true that we look like Glorcon. He was one of us. We were four, but he has broken free. Chair Orpian, is it true you were the owner of the dogs that power Glorcon? Yeah, it's definitely the right Chair Orpian. You should have seen, seen their apartment. No. So what Trover is saying is true. You are the owner of the dogs. I told you guys. We need to meet this Chair Orpian face to face. You must come to our home world, our inner sanctum. Wow, whoa, you're in the inner sanctum void, wow. Nobody's ever been to the abstainer's inner sanctum. Oh, mama. This is going to be, that's going to be quite a, a little deluxe travel package. How does somebody even get to the abstainer's inner sanctum? You must find the crystal of Ithacles. It is located in a place called Shleamy World. Oh, oh, I know where Shleamy World is. All right, okay. All right, Trover. Now, I'm sure you can see better as to why you, I needed you to stick around. We need you to protect this chair Orpian. You and the chair Orpian are a team. You're partners now. You're together. You're you're gonna need to go get that fucking crystal in from Shleamy World so that you can meet the abstainers face to face. Once you retrieve the crystal of Ithacles, you can plug it into the telepod. It will give you access to our inner sanctum. We must meet this Chair Orpian in person. It's of the utmost importance. Okay, all right, we got it. Jesus, Chair Orpian, uh, go ahead and hit the button on the telepod there uh, to teleport to Shleamy World. Yeah, Jesus Christ, man, fuck. This is bullshit. Trevor, I don't want to hear any bullshit from you. Fuck you. Yeah, all right, okay. You should have fucking let me know that this was po a possibility. I don't like surprises. Trevor, there are higher things at stake here than, than that right now. So quit being a little baby and do as I ask. I'm your boss. I'm the one who pays your bills. Man, we had a deal and you're changing it Chair up. Scorpion, hit the button on the telepod. I don't want to hear Trover anymore. Okay, we're going to hang up now. Good, good luck. You know, we had a deal, man. You know, you uh, bring back the Chair Orpian, get some space money. That was the deal. Trover, there's bigger things at stake now. I don't know what you were going to go do, but whatever it was, it was going to be supplied by my space money. Whatever recreational activities that you were so excited to go do that now you can't do that, that are making you so upset... That was going to be paid for by my space money. Just like everything in your in your little shitty existence is funded by my space money. So I need you to shut the fuck up and do what the fuck I tell you to yeah, do. Yeah, okay. I'm I'm doing it. I but am I I I I just don't like surprises, you know? I know I'm work for hire, but just let me give me a heads up, you know? G tell me there's the chance that this could turn into a bigger job. Trevor, is all. I don't give a shit about what you just said. Shut the fuck up and just Chair Orpian, will you hit the button on the telepod? Get the fuck Jesus man, Jesus fucking that guy's a fucking asshole. Man, I didn't I didn't sign up for this shit, you know? And now the abstainers are involved. Fuck man, the the, the abstainers, man. Imagine every time you've jerked off, they they've seen it. Every time you, you they watch they know they literally can describe to the minorest detail every time you've taken a shit. They know every single moment. They know everything. They've seen everything. I don't like them. I don't. I, I don't. I, I, they make me uncomfortable. The abstainers. Hey! 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 Look at me! Hey! Hey! Look at me! Hey! I'm Mr. Pop Up, and I need your help. All right, who, who is this guy? I told you I'm Mr. Pop-Up. I called a number. I, I don't know who I called. They're just supposed to come and help me. All right, well, it's not us. Now no, leave. Now fuck off. There's a man named Michael, and he, and he built a house on the bluff, and, and that's not zoned for residential usage. It's zoned for public use, and I'm very... You've got to help me out. 
I can't do anything. This guy, Michael, he's a total asshole. He's he's treated me like shit my whole life. Good. Now go away. No, it's bad. He thinks he's hot shit and can do whatever he wants. It's not fair. Sitting up there in his, in his red house, I would have built my house up there, but I didn't because I know how to follow the rules. You're disgusting. You're naked. Go away. I know you guys will help me if I just keep at it. The squeaky wheel gets the grease. That's what my mom taught me as a baby. If I kept crying, she would eventually give me more nipple milk. I learned that at a very young age. If I'm really loud and abrasive and complain, I'll eventually get what I want. I'm gonna rip that little band-aid that's covering up whatever's under there and put it on your mouth. I'm sorry you don't like me. I, I really am. But I need your help and, and you're the only people here. So if you just help me, then I'll go away. Otherwise, you're just going to have to deal with it. I'm Mr. <coughs> oh, I, I'm, hold on, I'm choking on something here. I'll be right back. Jesus, I hope whatever he's choking on kills him. All right, you got it. Let's keep going. Oh, help! Oh, I'm being attacked! Shit, there's a bunch of little gremlins over there. They just killed me. Y you see the hearts on, on, on your controller? When those go down to zero, I die. And if you find any red power babies, those things will give me health. The more important thing is we focus on finding the crystal of Ithacles. Oh, looking for the crystal of Ithacles, huh? Well, I have the crystal of Ithacles right here. I'm the one who has the crystal. Big surprise, big reveal. Holy shit, how did you get that? The abstainers gave it to me like 50 years ago to hold on to. You guys want it? You guys need this? Of all the people that have it, yes. We need it, please. Okay, well, now you have to do what I say. Get that guy Michael off the bluff. Here, I'll, I'll help you out. You're gonna need a chair upgrade because you can't even see over this log. So I'm gonna give you a chair upgrade. Here it comes. Your chair upgrade. <laughs> hey, what the hell? You know this if you just spit all over the chair? No, no, no. I, I just gave him a chair upgrade. It's, it's how we do things around here. I, we spit. Pop up with me. It's your new magical chair upgrade. Okay, good. Now do it again. You can pop up even higher. Pop up higher. Try it out. Okay, good. Do you see the house? Use your blinky blinksters and look at it. It's way back there. You have to see it. Don't you see it? It's the house with smoke coming out of the chimney. Jesus, have you have you never seen a house before? It's 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 right there. It's right there. <laughs> Turn your damn head and look at the house! Fine, if you don't want to look at the house right there, then fuck it! Forget about it! All right, listen, if you ever lose track of me, press down on R3, and your chair will focus right on me. That's the connection from the Power Babies. Yep, see, now you're focused on me. You don't have to move the camera to f ah! Yep, see, now you're focused on me. You don't have to move the camera to follow me around anymore. Man, we were supposed to just get the crystal of Ithacles and get on out of here to the abstainers area. And now we gotta deal with all this- Oh crap. Well, this is as far as we go. Got our slither. We should check the area for any buttons or switches or anything. Oh shit, look, look above the gate. One, one of these things got a thumbs up on it. Before they were all three, like, red. Y y you solved one of the puzzles when you hit the button. Try, try popping up, you know? Ch check it out up there. Oh yeah, I, I see, I see what you're looking at up there. Three buttons. Ooh, that's a lot harder than one button. Jeez, that's three buttons, I don't know. That's rough, that's pretty hard. I don't know how you're... Whoa, holy shit! We got two green thumbs up. One more puzzle somewhere. Try, try popping up higher. I bet there's another puzzle up there. These, these ridiculous buttons or something. Probably more pu... Whoa, well holy shit, dude. I mean, I can see that puzzle from down here. That, that's insane. That's an insane puzzle! I mean, what the hell? Y you doing alright? Jesus!
Francis, I don't know. Sh should we check online? I mean, maybe there's a strategy guide online. The hell were they thinking? What the hell were these were the developers thinking with all these buttons? That's not fun. This isn't fun. This isn't a good game. Just a bunch of buttons. It's lazy. Fuck this, dude. Come down. C come back down. C f screw this shit. Screw this shit, man. Just come down. We're not messing around with this. We're not messing around with buttons. No way. Uh-uh. I'm fed up. Yeah, you know what? Fuck it. Fuck that puzzle up there. Let's just yeah, screw that gate. Another green power, baby. Dude, you are making my day. All right, this is what I'm talking about, man. Thank you. Green power, baby. Mama's gonna get stoned. Hey, holy shit, there's a- there's one. A green power, baby. The green ones are super important to me. Hey, excuse me. How's it going? My name's Tony. I'm Upgrade Tony. I got a real issue over here, if you guys wouldn't mind just, uh, checking in with me. I got a real issue right now. Hey, yeah, what's the problem? I got these little ankle biters over here that are trying to kill me. It's giving me anxiety. Okay, well, what do you want us to do? I want you to kill them. If you kill them, I'll give you this awesome Power Baby upgrade that gives you a double jump and a glide. You can glide around with a double jump. It's so much fun. It's the funnest thing you've ever seen. Oh, man, I I've always wanted a double jump glide power baby upgrade. Yeah, I bet you do. If you kill these ankle biters and leave me amidst all this stress and anxiety I've got and panic attack, then I'll give you this power baby upgrade. The upgrade power babies are the most powerful ones. Uh, my favorite kind of power baby. We gotta take care of this. Yeah, why don't you take care of this stuff? Quit being a fucking stupid little bitch about it. Those are my pets. What are you, what are you out of your fucking mind? You just told us to kill them. What are you talking about? I told you to kill the ones in the courtyard. The wild feral ones. The ones you just killed were my domesticated pets. They were my friends. Oh, Jesus, man, you gotta be a little more specific. Shit, dude, I'm sorry. You know I don't even care anymore. Take your fucking upgrade here. It's on the fucking counter. I don't even know why I'm giving it to you. Okay, check this out. Watch this. This is crazy. Fucking eat each other! You see this shit? He's eating the other ones. Fucking insane. That's what they do when you put them close together. Isn't that crazy? And all the powers are now in, in, in combined into this one power, baby. And here we go. We're ready to double jump, baby. We got the double jump now. You fucking murderous, evil bastard monsters that killed my fucking best friends. I'm gonna. I gotta go. I gotta move. Up. I gotta pack up. This place has too many memories. I can't live here. I can't be here. I can't have my stand here no more. <laughs> Oh, hey, check it out, a secret little area. It's our little secret island here. 
So, you know, power babies are, like, super important, man, because the red ones give me health, but, like, the green ones, I'm trying to save those because they're an endangered species, and if you collect them, that'll really put some skin in the game for me, you know? It's like tipping an Uber driver. Plus, they get me really high w when I have them in my eye socket. Like, I get really high off of the power baby's energy. It's like, uh, when shamans make you drink ayahuasca to reflect for 24 hours on the spirits that are haunting your body. You know, if you collect them all, I swear to God, I will make sure there's some fucking insane thing at the end of this- ah! Anyways, like I was saying, I will make sure there's some fucking insane thing at the end of this game. Like, w at the very final part of this game, I will make sure that there's some insane-ass gift for you, but only if we collect all the green power babies, alright? But if you don't, you know, fuck you. you, that means you don't care about me. Once this adventure's over, I'm gonna be wasted for a while. Oh yeah, green power, baby. You done did it. better. <laughs> press the jump button and then when I'm at my highest peak, press it again and then hold it down and, you'll, and I'll glide. I'll jump higher and glide. Do you understand? Whoa, you did it. I knew you could do it. I believed in you. We should probably go over to the left and, and check out that area because there might be so, like a green power baby or two and those are really important for me, man. It means a lot to me. You don't understand. Like, I need some skin in this... Hey, good looking out, partner on the green power baby. Sick. Alright, so look, there's these flowers that open when you look at them, and then and then they bounce me up. They're bounce flowers, so look at them, and then the petals will open. Whoa, yeah, see? Pop up! Pop up so you can see better! What the fuck? Ah, we got you. You're fucked now. You, you're totally fucked. Who the hell are you? We're clones of Glorcon. Can't stop us. There's tons of us. There's a whole bunch of us, and we're gonna kill you. We're gonna murder you. you you're not gonna get through. You're not gonna get very far with us around. There's so many of us. You, you could kill a couple, but we're just gonna keep coming at you. Hey, did you tell them about how they're not gonna get very far? No, I forgot. Shoot. All right, you're not gonna get very far. Hold on. I wanted to say. Okay, it. hold on. All right, you go. You say it. You yeah, enough of it. I'm over it. Well, this guy's crazy. Stop him. Oh. Ronald! Okay, all right, we, we killed them all. Let, let's keep going. Uh, yeah, what the hell? Getting any further. We're just gonna keep warping uh, in. We're gonna make sure uh, you don't uh, proceed and interfere with uh, the uh, evil uh, plan. Hey, Cherorpian, uh, your uh, dogs are dying right yeah, now. Yeah, your stupid dogs are, are, are uh, annoying and loud, and I, I wish we could just give them back. We can't give them back. Those are the dogs that power Glorcon. Yeah, I know they are. Whoa, whoa. Uh, hey, that's hey, it, motherfucker. Hey, that's so uh, uh, get them. Uh, Oh, you cut my friend with a sword. Oh, you killed my. <laughs> Fuck them. Okay, enough of that. Yeah. Uh, Fuck you. <laughs> Fuck you. Get him. <laughs> no, you cut 
my friend with a sword. Oh. Too easy, man. Get it, Glorcon is cloning us at his secret base and warping us in. There, there's there's an infinite amount of he us. He can't do nothing to stop us. Yeah, you tell him. I'm telling him. I've already told him. You're a couple of stupid, dumb idiots. You're idiots. You're never gonna f f figure anything. Tech, kill him. Here, you son of a bitch. Yo. I never sucked a kill my friend. Uh, you're fucked now. feel bad for these guys. Geronimo! <laughs> Woo, that was fun, but it took damage, partner. Man, this means a lot to me, dude. These green power babies are like my fucking. This is what keeps me pumping. Partner, hit the R3 button. It'll focus your vision on me. Did you forget me? 
Would you get the fuck out of here? You almost got me killed! Who, me? My bad. I just wanted to remind you to get rid of Michael's house and I will give you the crystal of Ithacles! What an asshole! These green power babies collecting them, this is what makes me devoted to you and your cause, you know? Platformers there. my house this is where i live it's in a properly zoned area this is where residential houses are allowed to be and michael's house you're going to destroy it otherwise you won't get this the crystal of ithacles anyways good luck you fucking shit fucks fuck you i'm going inside man that guy's an asshole gonna be a pain in my ass. I'm too old for this shit. You just done got another green power, baby. Cha-ching. Somebody give me a money dollar. God damn! Come on! God damn it! Seriously! you from getting any further don't slam attack us though please yeah just whatever you do don't use your slam attack it'll hurt us like one point more damage than usual they'll never use a slam attack they're idiots yeah i know they are guess who's the smartest slam attack. The fuck slam. Yo -ho. Yeah. holy shit you just you just knocked that guy off the ledge Jesus Christ, this looks like it's gonna be tricky. Try not to get me killed. Oh, well, shit, that worked. G good, good job. Oh, look who it is, Thelma and Louise. I hope you guys are happy. I just buried my pets that you murdered. You fucking monsters. I moved up here and created a new life for myself to get away from people like you. And here you are. I can't be safe anywhere. Oh, fuck. Oh, oh, I'm so sad. <laughs> You guys fucking die. Trover and the Cherorpion. 
You think you're going to be able to defeat Glorkon's minions and clones, but you will never defeat us. And we will stop you and murder you before you're able to even come close to getting to Glorkon. Because we are the most powerful clones of Glorkons. All right, everybody, attack! My nipples are still not pierced! Hey, what the fuck? I'm gonna fuck you up, punk! One of all, you can't hurt me. Oh, yeah, uh, yeah, he. Uh, I have more hit points. Uh, oh, shit, you killed me. Oh, I was supposed to be the best. He told me I would be the one to stop you. No, fuck you. Man, Glorkon's not fucking around sending all those clones after us like that. All right, well, well we're basically at Michael's house. Let's go. man this is a private event i don't give a shit we're here to push your house over the cliff oh 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 you're pushing this house over this one right here yeah give me one sec what the fuck are you doing what is that is that is that shit oh sorry about that i guess i forgot what direction my toilet was in oh get the fuck out of here get the hell off my property this is a private event look asshole we need the crystal of ithocles mr pop-up said mr pop-up Crystal of Ithocles? Shit, that guy's just pissed because I ate his family. Wait, seriously? That's right. But what Pop-Up needs to realize is that we're all just meat. Their energy is still around. I just ate their meat, okay? Energy never dies. Their flesh can be consumed, but their spiritual energy is still in the cosmos, you fucking assholes. Tell you what, I'll give you my Crystal of Ithocles right here. If you knock that boulder over the cliff on a Mr. Pop-Up's house and kill him. Now, if you'll excuse me, I'm going to go back inside where I have a, a whole mess of pregnant ladies strapped onto the floor where I'm using an intricate network of fluids to inject into their bodies and induce early birth so that I can consume the flesh of their fetuses, okay? Is that okay? Jesus, another one of these types. Cherubian, turn me facing you so we can talk for a second. All right, listen, I wasn't even supposed to be here. What do you want to do? Do you want to kill Mr. Pop-Up? We, 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 we got to kill somebody. We got to pick one because I want to get the stupid shard of Ithocles and get out of here. Okay, so what, do, what, are, you, what are you thinking? You, you want to kill Mr. Pop-Up? partner like we did with the old man yes or no like nod your head yes or shake your head no so you want to kill michael then okay yeah i mean the guy this guy michael's talking about injecting fluids into pregnant women and inducing pregnancy and eating the, their babies i mean I, I see where you're coming from okay so you want to kill michael then yeah 
Yeah, and plus, the fact that he reached into his ass and, and got a ball of shit and threw it in your face. I mean, for God's sakes. Uh, final answer. We kill Michael? Yes or no? Yes or no? Like, nod, nod yes for yes and shake your head no for, for no. Hello, did you hear me, partner? It's a yes or no question. Okay, let's kill Michael then. Knocking a house filled with innocent pregnant women right off a cliff. Here we go. Here it goes. Dude, what the hell? Knock it off. Seriously, stop. You're fucking done, man. You're done. Fucking done! No, please! I'm begging you! We don't care! You're gonna kill a bunch of pregnant ladies and ruin my dinner! Alright! Hey, you- hey! Oh my god, you guys did it! You killed Michael! Oh my god! You, you guys actually did it! I thought you guys would have just picked one of those crystals up off the ground! It, it seems like the most logical way to way to go about things! What are you talking about? You did it! I didn't know- I didn't think you would have had what it takes! I'm not gonna lie. I'm really sad that Michael's gone. But I've got bigger issues ahead of me. I need to find out where all my pregnant wives are. Here's your crystal of Ithacles, you dum-dum. These are all over the place. I pulled this one out of my ass. My little schmubbler got all rosy. Ah, uh, Jesus Christ. He had that crystal up his ass. I don't want that in my... I don't want that in my telepod. All right, get the fuck out of here. Go to that special teleportation warp node. That'll warp me back to the telepod you came in. Get the fuck out of my world, you limp leg. Chair fuck and you stupid suck it head. I'm Mr. Pop-Up and I'm gonna beat off thinking about you guys. I gotta tell you, you know, you surprised me back there, Chair Orb. Well, wow, we teleported, we're here. Holy shit. What, th there's crystals everywhere! How do we miss all these? What, did we not notice these before? They're all over the place! And there's a crystal! Look, there's- uh, there's crystals there! Oh shit, yeah! We just got a green power baby, man! Another green power, baby! Endangered power baby, we just saved it. You have no idea how much this means to me, man. Alright, I'm plugging the crystal of Ithacles into the telepod. Alright, listen, we're back in the telepod, and the first order of business is let's store some of those green power babies. Alright, so just rotate around until you see the, the the big red button. That's the power baby suction button. Just ro you'll find it. Just rotate around until you see the big red button. You're gonna be doing this all the time. So you better just <coughs> Get used to it! Oh shit! You got enough green power, baby! 
maybe to give me a, a a new hit point, a new health point. Oh my god, I'm gonna now I can take more damage. Oh, see that's what happens when you collect these green power babies. All right, okay, we're we're really rocking and rolling. All right, yeah, yep, you got more green power babies. Good work. You know, I don't want you to forget that there's an amazing, awesome unlockable prize if you get all the power babies. I'm just gonna, that's all I'll say about it. Oh shit, you better Trover, answer that. Chair person, good work. You got the crystal and it looks like Trover's already installed it and upgraded the telepod. Now you just have to teleport to the abstainer's home world, inner sanctum. Very rare opportunity for anyone. Good work guys, uh, we'll talk to you soon, bye. Jeez, Chair Orpian, I gotta admit, I never saw you, I never thought you had it in you to cold-bloodedly murder somebody like that. Whew, glad I'm not on your bad side. You know, you're gonna do pretty good out here in this cosmos, you know? You're gonna do pretty good when we part ways right after this next part of the game, when we split up, because I'm going my way and you're going your way, and they're not intertangled at all, and that's all I gotta say about that. Jeez, this is where the abstainers live? In a giant, foggy void? Must be nice. What are you doing? Come see, talk to us. We are the abstainers. We request your presence. We must talk to you in person. We're very interesting to look at. You'll want to see us. Trust me, you'll, wanna, you'll want to come and be in our presence. It's cool. It looks cool, especially in virtual reality. Because you'll, you'll be able to look around and feel a strong sense of presence, like you're actually here. So come to our inner sanctum and talk to us, please. We have things to speak with you about. We are the abstainers. We could talk more about a bunch of inside shit, but, you know, whatever. We're the abstainers. Just come to hang out. Come and hang out with us. Let's just chill out. What are you doing? You're just fucking around. Come chill with us. Ah, they have arrived. Welcome, Trover. Yeah, uh, yeah, thanks for having us, you know. Ah, yes, welcome. It's true. The dogs were yours. The bond you have is strong. You are the chair-bound one. He who is dis destined to defeat Glorkon. We are the abstainers. We see all. We know all. But we can no longer be sure of the future. Slow talker. Now that Glorkon has broke free, he was one of us. We were four in total. Now we're just three. I mean, it's a bunch of bullshit, really, if you think about it. He fucked us. Now we're three. We abstain from interfering with anything, because we don't fuck with shit. And we're the abstainers, and we abstain from stuff. Um, listen, so... The clones, we, we've been running into Glorcon clones. They said a bunch of bad stuff is coming. Oh, oh, jeez. Oh, my God. Oh, dub, 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 oh, dub, dub. Dub. that's bad. That's just bad stuff. That's a bad sign. Uh, this means Glorcon is proceeding with his plan to destroy the universe, the cosmos, everything. Wait, what? what? D destroy the whole cosmos? That's right, you little purple hunk. And you two together are our, our only hope. Uh, you must collect Glorcon the clones. You must collect their guts. We will be able to use that to peer into Glorcon's mind so we're able to see what his next moves are. It's the only way we can stop the horrible things from happening. What are you talking about, us? I, I, I don't want to deal with this. Get the fuck out of here. Hurry. Get the fuck out of here. Just to reiterate, we are the abstainers. We used to be able to see all timelines. Every version of reality we could peer into. We abstain from interfering with everything. Now that Glorcon left, we're broken down. We can't see anything. We don't know what the fuck is going on. We need to peer into Glorcon's mind so we know what his plans are. So that we can stop It's a them. bunch of bullshit. This whole thing is bullshit. We weren't Jesus, finally they're gone. Now I can take these pants off. 
Oh, oh, that's the stuff. Gotta air it out sometimes, you know. Oh, yes, I know. I'm gonna leave mine on, though. Why would you leave yours on? I don't want to well, air mine Let's leave them to right it. Now. Why not? Because I don't feel like airing it out. Oh, I'm, I miss being all of us in sync when we used to take our pants off and air out our little sacks all at the same time. Okay, cool. Let's get out of here. All right, that's probably the boss calling. You should answer the phone. Hello? Hello? Uh, what's going on? Boss, we're in some deep stuff over here. The stakes have been raised. Glorcon's trying to destroy the whole universe, and the abstainers want us to stop him. Uh, hold on, Chover. Shut the fuck up. Let me talk to the Chair Orpian here. Chair Orpian, is it true? Have the stakes been raised? Huh. Okay, so what you say is true, Trover. The stakes have been raised, according to the Chair Orpian. That's what I said! Shut up, Trover. Trover, what are you gonna do? You gonna fucking sit on your little... Pansy ass while the whole cosmos gets blown up and destroyed? Or are you gonna fucking pony up? You and the Chair Warpian are the only hope. The Abstainer said it to me earlier. I didn't want to tell you about it. You are bitching and moaning. You're gonna to go to Shroomia, and you're gonna find Doopy Duper. He has a cauldron, a vessel, a little receptacle, whatever. I need you to fill up the Glorcon clone guts into the cauldron and, and come back to the telepod, all right? Now get the fuck out of here. I'm gonna go shoot some hoops. Well, you heard him. We gotta to go to Planet Shroomia. Man, I thought we would be wrapping it up back there. You know, this is turning out to be a way bigger deal than I thought it would be. You know, listen, I'm a whole monster. You're a Cherorpion. We're not meant to be a team, but we're partners now. You hear that? I acquiesce. We're partners. I don't want to be together with you, but we are. And we're in way over our heads. So, you know, just don't screw anything up. Let's just do what we came to do, all right? Hit the button so we can get out of here. All right, here we are, here in, here in shit land, about ready to get shit on. All right, boss said that Doopy Duper would, would have the cauldron, the magical vessel or whatever that we need to get, so keep your eyes peeled for that house. Normal. Regular, single-story, ranch-style home, the two-car garage. Great, more pissed-off things that want us dead. Fantastic. All right, boss said that Doopy Duper would, would have the cauldron, the magical vessel or whatever that we need to get, so... Keep your eyes peeled for that house. Got another green power, baby. Dude, you are making my day. Understand the ranking system. We're all the clones. We're all the same. No, some of us are bigger, and some of us have more, take more hits to kill, and have, like, armor and things like that. So if you have armor, that means that you're bigger and tougher, because that's, that's a bunch of bull pucky. Bull pucky? Where'd you come up with that word? I didn't come up with it. Whoa! Well, well. Oh, well, look who it is. We got ourselves a little purple eye hole monster and a chair orpian. No doubt trying to penetrate our secret fort, get in here and ruin off, ruin our stuff. Well, it's not gonna happen. Cause we, we knocked it up another level. We're the Gorklon clones. Not gonna be able to do nothing around here. Not gonna be able to stop us. We're the toughest fucking guardians of this fort you'll ever meet. Not gonna be able to get into this fort. That's right. Let me go ahead and jump in here. I just want to say, uh, you guys ever heard of what a wall is? You guys know what a wall is? 
Yeah, do you guys know what a wall is? Hey, listen, let me... I got this. All right, go ahead. Do you guys know what a wall is? No, wh tell why you what don't you tell us? Is. It's a giant fucking wall. You can't get past it all. You can't even get through it. You can't dig under it. You know what I'm talking about? Hey, give me a high five, man. Good work. Thanks, man. These little two pumpkin heads aren't gonna be able to get in here. That's right. Now they know what. Now they know. Now they understand what they're up against. Oh, look, look, look. There they go. A couple of fucking idiots. Off on their way. Fucking dumbass piece of shits. Let's get back to guarding this fucking castle. Another green power, baby? What are you, Mother Teresa over here? <laughs> what a good guy. Oh, look who it is. Look who's back. Little lost babies. Anyways, what were we talking about? Hey, listen, man. You rub my asshole with your tongue. Yeah, I will. <laughs> just kidding. I'm not doing that. What? Come on. You just said you would. Nah, we're just gonna hang out. Let's get back to guarding this fucking castle. What do guards do? They stay quiet and they stay tough. Listen, partner, I don't want to do. go over there. I don't want to be anywhere near this area. It's, it's gross. It smells bad. It's a pool, a pond of decomposed power baby slime. Easy, easy, partner! You know, you better make sure every one of these jumps that you think about it and, and you time it just right because I'm not, I don't want to fall in this muck. And when I say muck, I'm referring to the ground up, disgusting remnants of power babies in this slimy, decomposed puddle below us. Well, there we are, a power baby. We did save a power baby. I hope it was worth it to you. And you didn't get me slimy from the power baby guts down there, so I'm gonna go ahead and say that that, that was the right call. Good work, partner. Let's keep going. We gotta, we gotta move. Stupid and stupid. The two stupid idiots. Anyway, wh wh where was I? Listen, uh, you see the newest episode of Clonefeld starring the Glorcon clones? It's like Seinfeld only with clones. Bam. It's a clone show about nothing. Oh crap, it's more of these mushroom monsters. Well, these little mushroom monsters are, are, are aggressive. Okay, partner, come on, let's go find Doopy Duper. Yo, person in need of some help over here, come on. Don't be that guy. Don't be that guy that ignores someone crying for... Hello? Hey, hey, are you are you Doopy Duper? Yeah, yeah, I'm Doopy Duper. That's right, that's me. Oh, bad luck, Doopy Duper. All right, listen, w w our boss sent us here because you're supposed to have some sort of magic cauldron vessel thing? You mean that bowl thing? Yeah, I know, that's long gone. Those chicken nugget characters stole it from me and locked it up in their castle fort thing. Those dudes? Damn it! Yeah, the only way to get into that fort is up on that cliff there. Just up there, past my house. Do you see it? Just right up there. You gotta turn your head to look. I'm pointing at it right now. Do you see it? Right up there? I'm just gonna wait right here until you look. Look, 
Yeah, that's it. And the only way you can get up to that cliff is if I reveal the secret staircase. Okay, yeah, so can you turn on the secret staircase? Oh, yeah, sure. I'll reveal it. It's super easy. I'll activate the secret staircase, but I just need you to help me move. Do you know how to pick stuff up and move it? Really? Well, that's all right. I got this chair upgrade you can use to help pick stuff up. And... All right, now you can pick up and move things, like my TV. Try it out. All you gotta do is look at the TV and press the R2 button. Simple as that. There you go. Now, if you wouldn't mind, bring it a little closer to me by using the D-pad. You can also rotate using left or right on just right. I don't want to miss it right in front of me. I know, it's my shows. So, now I just need you to move those boxes over to that house right there. The one with the basketball hoop. Yeah, now just set it anywhere in front of the house, right over there. You want some hard candies? Perfect! Right there is perfect! You know, I've had a tough time lately. I'm trapped in this mechanical chair, and it's rough being me. I, I got a little black cloud that follows me around. I say, good morning, black cloud, and the black cloud doesn't even say good morning back. We were supposed to pick our houses today, and I I picked this one, but I really should have picked that one. Because it's got a basketball hoop, and I've always wanted a basketball hoop. Everyone else picked houses up on the cliff. I don't know why I chose this one down here. I guess it's because I'm afraid of heights, and also it's tough getting around in this chair. Plus, the high altitude gives me the runs. Oh, it's the worst. I get it when I eat tuna salad, too, like clockwork. I take one bite and it comes spraying out of me like a lawnmower driving over a water balloon. Oh, you did it! Thank you so much! You must have been in the Gifted and Talented program. Yeah, okay, so activate the secret staircase, please? Yeah, actually, I changed my mind. Can you move the boxes in the garage? I checked the weather and it said it could rain. You know, I don't want to risk it. It would soggy up the boxes and I don't want to soggy the boxes up. So, could you just put them in the garage so the boxes stay safe and dry? Then I'll, I'll promise I'll open the staircase, okay? Listen, we're in a lot of trouble here, okay? We can't fuck around with this shit. We need to know where this cauldron vessel thing is. I understand, I really do, but this will only take... That's not where I want that box. Anywho, where was I? Oh yeah, so... I really appreciate you two doing this. All this moving is just so stressful, and, and you can never predict what the... Right, that's fine. Anywho, where was I? Oh yeah, so a bird captured me and attempted to eat me one time. The only reason why I'm still alive even is cause of, cause of my chair. Otherwise it would have swallowed me whole. Instead I was just repeatedly regurgitated for eight straight days. Probably similar to getting eaten by an anaconda. Uh, you know, I heard if you put your arms out in a wide T, an anaconda can only digest the bottom of your body. Anyways. There! The boxes are in the garage, okay? Now reveal the damn staircase! Oh, shoot! I wanted you guys to hold off on doing that. I just checked the weather, and it looks like it's all cleared up. Plus, it's so dark and scary in that garage. What? Come on! This is bullshit! We had a deal! Now reveal the staircase! Please stop yelling at me. You're scaring me. You're scaring old Duper here. Oh my god! This, this is it then! No more after this! Uh, we do this and then we get the secret staircase! No more, I promise. I never break my promise. Outside... 
Bless your weak little heart for doing this. You really make an old duper happy here. Anywho, where was I? Oh yeah, so outside is better. Trust me. I've moved so much in the past ten years, I've learned a thing or two. <sighs> hey, do you ever wonder about trees? The problem is with these trees that there are little berries that fall off of them and then they land on your roof and fall on your front porch. Ugh. Then you gotta clean them off, but you can't because they stain everything. They gunk up my wheels. You know what I'm talking about? They're not even edible. They're the worst. Sounds like someone I know. There, the boxes are outside. Now for fuck's sake, reveal the secret staircase. Okay, no need for foul language here. I will reveal the secret staircase, but not until one last thing. I want you to put the boxes on my roof. Go to hell! Hey, you want to get up that cliff? Then I'm going to need you to put those boxes on that roof. My new roof. Do you realize what's at stake? The entire universe could cease to exist. The whole universe. I didn't realize how crazy this shit was until just earlier. The whole universe is at stake. Well, that sounds pretty good to me. Turn on the secret staircase. Put the boxes on the roof. Trust me, this is the last thing. I hate moving just as much as the next guy. I can't wait to move into my new home, though. Take full advantage of that basketball hoop? I'm probably never gonna leave. Not that I was coming and going a whole lot, but now with that basketball hoop, I have no... I said I want them on the roof. Try it again. Anywho, where was I? Oh, yeah, so... I'll be able to do all the cool b-ball moves, including the... I don't understand why you can't figure this out. It's not that hard. Then you do it! Let's go back to what I was talking about. Fucking doopy duper probably greased the roof. That's why we can't get any traction. We keep sliding off. I gave you the upgrade specifically so I didn't have to. Now get off your bum bum and get to work. Sure, or beans can't get off their ass, okay? Partner, we gotta figure out a way to get up that cliff. Fucking doopy duper probably greased the roof. That's why we can't get any traction. We keep sliding off. This is fucking bullshit. I wonder if my new neighbors will like basketball. I hope so. There is nothing worse than having a neighbor that you do not get along with. It can ruin everything. My last neighbor was the worst. They always left all their windows wide open so that I could see everything. I'd sit there and just watch them. I didn't want to, but I had to. What other option did I have? Their window was wide open. I would look out and I would see them quickly getting ready for work in the morning because, you know, they had overslept again or they were having an intimate dinner with a work colleague. Are they allowed to do that? Sometimes they would fall asleep on the couch and I could not tell if they were still breathing. So I'd just go over there and wake them up to make sure they were the worst. Oh, sh I, we can't get on that roof of the house. But I am not worried about this new house. I know I made the right decision. I feel like it's really going to turn out great. I'm just ready to be done with moving. It's so exhausting. I had to wake up at the crack of dawn just to get started. I am so darn tired. Shut up! Say, I normally win it. Oh, that Who works! Oh, you freaking assholes! Oh, that sounds too bad like my mom. What a bunch of ninner pickles. You guys are jerks. We had an arrangement. Up yours, you friggin' buttwad. You're all buttwads. You guys are jerks. You're a bunch of friggin' jerks. Bunch of no gooders, that's what you are. Just like Jesus that Christ, this is the, a little doopy duper's a, a, a lunatic. Damn, partner, that was some quick thinking. Man, you must really hate helping people in wheelchairs. D you got us out of that mess real quick. D 
Damn, I thought we were never gonna get out of there. I mean, helping people move is the is the worst. They always make it seem like it'll be easy, but it never is. You know, even if it's just a couple of things. And then they offer to buy you a pizza or something. Like, like that's a fair trade. I don't think so. It's a bunch of bullshit, partner. It was pretty good moving up there, moving those boxes up there. It was a pretty good move. I hope somebody shits on their boxes. to get really muddy and pixelated. That's what I'm talking about, green power baby. Thank you. 